Hey everyone, it's been a while, but I've got a really nice big box of awesome to open up, so let's get into it. Okay, it's a few hours later. Connie and Iz up there are both enjoying the fireplace, and we can get into this box. So, what I found was, we got one, two three four five listings of sealed playstation and playstation 2 games but here's the kicker <clears throat> so if we go into this one here uh, see if we have to go into there this person had where's the mail um our seller for postage quote they had these items listed as pickup only so i messaged them i said if i pay full price for all of them will you ship them for free rather than you know making a best offer and they happily accepted it so in here we have one thousand two hundred and thirty dollars worth of sealed vintage video games so <laughs> this is quite a big um, outlay a big risk but thought it was um, worth it given what was in here and the people have wrapped them well which is even better so I might do a little bit of unwrapping and we'll catch up in a bit okay that didn't take as long as what I thought it would and heaps of bubble wrap but look at that all these beautiful sealed PlayStation 2 games this part here so we'll grab some out we'll start having a look at these So, World Destruction League, Thunder Tanks, <coughs> one of those ones, International Superstar Soccer, ESPN National Hockey Night, Ooh, oh, that sucks, a corner missing out of it, but that would have been in the picture, so I can't be upset, but that's a bit annoying because now that's definitely not graded and it's not really a sealed copy and that was like one of the main ones. So it's unfortunate. This one, as you can see, the plastics are coming a little bit loose. Battlefield 2. Alter Time, Alter Space, Alter Echo. Uh, I'm seeing a bit of the plastic. Not too great so far. Cold winter, let's see a bit of the seal there. Of course, that one's perfect. <laughs> Boxing ready to rumble. It's mostly intact. Kesson. A little bit of the seal missing there. And so these individually, I'll have to take a lot of good photos um, extreme G racing clever kids dino land SSX on tour was it that one's missing a bit too <coughs> Bob the Builder but they're still new they're just not a lot of these aren't gradable unfortunately things to Narnia. Oh, he's one of the big, big hitters. And it is perfect. That's from the best I've seen so far. Sonic Unleashed. Brand new sealed. Mr. Bean. Another pretty good one. Barbie. The Island Princess. I think that was a kid lot. One of the builder again. Go kart rally. Ford versus Chevy. This one I can feel it's a bit loose back here. I just walk. Dora. A 
doesn't sound loose in there, just weird, but only well. Disney Think Fast. It's another very good one. There's a strange thing. Idols, this one comes with the microphone. All sealed brand new. Pro Rally 2002. International Q Club. NHL 2005. If that's the booklet. David Beckham Soccer. A little bit of plastic missing there and ripped at the top here. Little Britain. Another Pamela Anderson game, VIP. Lethal Skies. Oh, God of War. It's an old um, JB Hi Fi. That's what they've had there security thing in there. Meet the Robinsons. Bolt. Open season. Oh, come on again. PK, this was a good one too. And it is perfect. Donald Duck PK sealed. When's this from? 2002, so 20 years old. Sealed new. Oh, here we go. Chippenden Ultimate Ninja 5. Hopefully, that's a PAL. Um, yeah, PAL. Downforce, yep. Not all generic titles, which is good. That's what another reason that drew me to it. it wasn't all you know, first party ones that you see everywhere. Like they're actually you know, some more obscure titles. Black and bruised. <laughs> that box is a little bit black and bruised. Circus Maximus. Big stick on the back of that. I think they call that 13. That's a pretty good one. A little bit of a big thing. Smuggler's Run is a like early, early PlayStation 2. This one, I think it's 2000. Yeah, 2000. The old black case before they went blue. I know there was part of it, but a lot was the early runs. So this would be a first edition, and yeah, one of the first games for PlayStation 2. Now, on to I'll show you this one first. PlayStation 1. Sealed. <laughs> this was the bulk of it. This lot here was, um, I think, 450 of the $1,200 was PlayStation 1. But I've got to open the rest of that bag. Okay. Last little stack, and this is all PlayStation 1. You've got to realise, too, in Australia, finding vintage video games sealed is rare like us you see it quite a bit here it's just something that you never see that's why i thought i'll take a chance on this lot especially after i sold the playstation one game sealed for 450 dollars a shame one cricket <clears throat> and that'll probably be even worth more now killer loop Whoop. these ones are good too because i definitely will be sending these in parcels <laughs> whereas those the lower end ones i have to i can send in envelopes but these ones here they don't fit an envelope, so there's no issue with um, postage method because they have to be in a parcel. V Rally. Shame it's a platinum one because this is one of the first 
PlayStation 1 games that I can remember. A little bit of a, a nick in that corner. What sort of years are we talking here? 1998 for the Platinum version. Oh, this looks a bit unique. Carnage Heart. 1997 Black Machine Head That's the beauty of buying things like this and lots that not only people are going to buy a whole heap but people are going to happily buy one if it's a game they loved or a game they need for their collection like you know like if you do decide to open it it's pristine inside Rush Down to the extreme rush down. A little bit of a nick in that one, unfortunately. Someone would have bought these next to nothing at the end. Impact Racing. <laughs> and last but not least, geez, that's a thick booklet in that one. Complete Inside Soccer. That's everything there. So that's $1,200 worth of sealed UVA games. See you.